Sorry I'm late, honey. We're gonna get her done, okay? All right, A. Martin, you're first, honey. A. Martin 421, this is a subscriber call. Thank you guys for being here on Sunday. I just want to warn you, I bite tonight. I'm going through the heat of menopause. I have no room for bullshit from nobody. Nobody. I'm going to grab my Nintendo while you're doing these calls. to an automatic voice message system. Seven. Our call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Seven. Six. Five. <laughs> Sorry. Ah. I'm losing my damn mind. Hi, y'all. Happy, happy Sunday. All has been forwarded to an voice message system. Two, zero is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press one for more options. Hi, honey. It's Sue. I'm just trying to get in touch with Melanie. Melanie, um, I... I found you on Ancestry, and I'm actually your half-sister on your daddy's side. Or our daddy's side. You know, he kind of neglected me. Went out for milk and never came back, is what they say. <laughs> but, um, I married my first cousin. I didn't know it was my first cousin, and we've had a baby, so we're actually cousins with your niece. <laughs> but, um, just call me back, and we can talk about it more, honey. Bye. Heather Plaster or another mod or another subscriber call, honey. Thank you, A. Martin. Thank you, Sweet Pea. I'm sorry, but the person you Hey, honey, it's Sue. How are you doing? Is this Shannon? Is this Shannon? Yes. Shannon, um, I notice you whenever you're you're bringing our, your kid to drop him off to school. Um, I've noticed him flirting with my little girl, and I just need to put a stop to this immediately. I would never let... I, my, I don't have a child in school. It's, 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 you drop off Eli. Is that not your kid? Who is this? Sue. Well, you kind of look old. Maybe he's your grandson. I'm sorry? Excuse me? I said you may, You kind of look old. Maybe it's your grandson. Okay. Uh, I mean, I, no, but how'd you get my number? I got it from the school system just because, um, you know, no, Lon London... I don't have a grandson named Eli. Well, London identifies as lesbian. And you will not, your grandson is not welcome anywhere near my London. What, I'm sorry, what, what's your grandson's name? Your grandson's name is Eli. Uh, no, I mean, what is your grandson's name? My granddaughter's name is London. London? London. London? Yes. Hold on, hold on one second. Talk to my husband. I don't, I don't, I don't want to talk to no man, honey. I'm talking to you. Okay, so... 
I, just, I don't understand what you're saying. I don't know. My granddaughter is way too good for Eli. I don't want him anywhere near her. She's a lesbian. Um, I don't have a grandson named Eli. I don't understand what you're saying. <laughs> Are you not Shannon? I don't understand what you're saying right Girl, now. Girl, don't play dumb with me. I know this is Shannon. What is, what is your name? Sue. Sid? No, dude. It's Sue. Sue. Sue? Sue Dillon. Sue Dillon. Yes. I don't I don't know how you got my number. I got your number from the school. You did not. I did. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to call the police right now. This Sue is, Dillon? That's a little crazy to call the police over someone calling you on the phone, honey. Come on. Now. I don't under why don't you call his mother or their mother, or your... I, I don't understand what's happening right now. Well, you're the one that drops them off, so I thought that you could say something. How do you even know me? How would you even call me? London told me what your name was. She talks to Eli. Apparently, he has a big crush on her. I, d I doubt that. He does, and I he needs to steer clear. Listen, I got your number. Still Great. Going. Great. If that's your name, your granddaughter's name is uh, London? Yes, ma'am. No, 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 no need to be scared. All I wanted to say was there is no dating allowed. I'm sorry? There's no need to be freaked out. All I wanted to say was there is no dating allowed between your feral child and my pedigree daughter. I'm not, I'm not understanding any of this conversation right now. <laughs> I get that vibe, I do. So, right. I don't, I don't know. All right. All right. Thanks for calling. Anytime. Have a good night. Anytime, honey. Becky, it's your turn, honey. I'm going to call the police now. Oh, wait. Never mind. Becky didn't order a call. She just said, hi, Sue. Sarah, thank you so much for the pastor's wife crank phone call. We had a lot of fun with this. God bless you and have a great day. My neck, my back, my Jesus, and my crack. I said, my neck, my back. My Jesus and my crack. I said, my neck, my back, my Jesus and my crack. If you want a prank phone call right now on TikTok only, you can send an interstellar and I will do one right now. Thank you, David. That is the only way to get one. I know it's expensive as hell, honey, but I am booked up, bricked up, and horned up, and I am ill. I am not a customer service agent, but I have to be with all these prank call orders. I am blessed but stressed, honey. All right, Stephzilla. Also, merchandise is 15% off code Sue on the link tree on my profile. Can't come to the phone right now. Leave a message and I'll call you back. Hey, Lady Liberty friend. Can't come to the phone right now. Leave a message and I'll call you back. Can't come to the phone right now. Leave a message and I'll call you back. Hey, baby. Um, I got your number, Brad, from someone I go to church with. They said you're an RN, and I have a wart on my foot that I can't bend over and reach. My foot is too fat for it, and I can't bend over and get to it. God, I got GERD, too. It's really stressing me out. This award is. So I was wondering how much it'd cost you, <clears throat> or cost me, rather, to get you in here to treat the award. Um, just let me know. Call me back when you can. I'll pay anything. My husband won't do anything with me until it's gone. He said, HPV. I said, honey, this is not HPV. That's in your cooter. Anyway, I'm being a little too much. I'm going to get off here, but you're a nurse, so you can handle it. Bye. Okay, we're doing Lola Trimbeth, honey. 
Thank you, Chase. If y'all want a prank call right now on TikTok only, you can send me an interstellar. It's my gift goal. An interstellar. It is the gift goal. I will friend you and get the call from you right now. That's the only way to get one right now. Because I am bricked up, booked up, and horned up, honey. Oh my gosh, thank you, David. Showing off. the mess that I created. You made a mess. Lola, this man does not want to answer my calls. We have tried him three times now. Lola's in the chat, right? This is your dad. Thanks. Did you fix it? Yeah, I think so. Did you just say that I'm crazy? What did you say? I don't know the exact pass. Did you? Were you nice? Yes, of course. Hello? 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 Thank you, Emma. Like diamonds in the sky. Oh my god, did he screen my effing call? Honey, read the sign. I am not a Trump supporter. I am a me supporter. Sue Dillon 2024. Who are you? Been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hi, honey, this is Sue. Um, it's me again calling about the grocery store. You know, there was shit on my bananas, and it's for membership 3831. Please call me back. Please. For the love of everything good and evil. Bye. All right, Lola, let's go ahead and do Fran. Listen, if it was really getting old, would so many people be watching it, you little chode? Ugh.
spraying. It was me. It was me. My dogs bark at me every time I speak. I don't understand why. Is this Fran? Fran, can you hear me okay? No. You can't? No. What about now? Can you hear me better? Can you hear me? What? I'm saying your dog has been shitting in my yard. I don't have a dog. Yes, you do, Mr. Chips. Oh, I gave my dog uh, to my daughter last week. Finally, maybe this is this is a yeah, gift from God. I gave my dog away. Praise the Lord you, on you high. Me? Praise the Lord yeah, on are high. You happy? Yes, because your dog you ain't going. Yes, I'm so happy. Okay. See you later. Bye. All right, Lola Trimbeth, we got you done, finally. All right. This one is a link tree request for Krobic. Oh, like Shine bright like a diamond. Shine bright like a diamond. Shine bright like a diamond. Um, hello, Annie. How are you doing? I'm fine. Who is this? This is Sue. Um, I met you at that bar on East Side on Austin. Who are you calling? Jameen. Yeah, you met me? Yes, baby. You gave me your number. You seem to be really impressed with me. <laughs> how long ago was this? It's been a while. You know, I just found the number in my laundry. I know, and I, I'm sorry that it's been so long. It took me a long time to email back, or to text back, rather. Back in my day, it was email, but nowadays it's texting, and you never did respond, so I thought I'd just give you a call. How long ago was this? Maybe last month. In East Austin, what far was it? Shit, honey, I go to a different one every night. I can't remember. This is a joke, right? No, I was wondering if you'd want to come over and fornicate with me tonight. <laughs> no, I'm good. Okay, well, if you change your mind, I'm ready. <laughs> okay, I'm still trying to figure out who's playing a joke on me right now. <laughs> Baby, why do you think it's a joke? It's, it's serious. <laughs> I'm serious about romance. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Have you ever been with a grandma? I take it you haven't since you're cackling. You're probably red in the face, aren't you? You can't say I have, no. Just because they sag don't mean they don't hit right, honey. <laughs> right on, Grandma. <laughs> well, baby, you know where to call if you need me. Uh-huh, sure thing. You have a great night. I hope you find your match. <laughs> Thank you, baby. He'll call back. He'll call back. He'll be horned up. He'll call back. He'll call back. <coughs> All right. <coughs> Violet Lion. How are you doing? Good. Uh, this is Sue. I work in the school systems. I'm in the front office a lot. Um, is this Sean? This is Sean. Sean, um, a lot of us have been wondering if you've been doing okay. We've been worried about you. Uh, I'm fine. We're, Why are you worried about me? Well, the, the quality of your work has is, is fallen below 
average, honey, and we're just, it's not like you to leave skid marks on the toilets and to not clean up the vomit all the way. Like, we saw where someone vomited, and you use that mulch stuff on it, but, um, it didn't, you didn't sweep it up. It, there was a pile of it left. I actually swept it up, and this is just not like you, and I just thought, you know, let's not talk shit, ladies. Maybe he's depressed. You know, you know, I haven't had any vomit spills, uh, but I do my work to the best I can. You, you're doing a good job, honey. You really are. So don't take offense, okay? Okay. I just mean it with love. Thanks. Who are you now? Uh, my name. <laughs> oh, God, I'm so sorry. When I get nervous, I have, like, a really bad GERD symptoms, so I apologize for that burp. Okay. Um, but <clears throat> I was just saying, my name is Sue. Sue. Yes, it's Sue Dillon. Sue Dillon. Wonderful. Well, Sue Dillon, I'm a healthy mind, and uh, I'm actually at work right now. Doing oh. Job. oh, okay. Well, you know what? I'm sure you're doing a great job. I just really wanted to check in. It's like a wellness check is all. That's Fantastic, it. Sue. Yes, and you can always lean on me, honey. Thank you. Yes, and when you're not strong and you need a friend, I'll help you carry on and on. It won't be long. I'll be... We all need somebody to lean on, lean on me. When you're not strong, I'll be your friend. I'll help you carry on, on, on and on. It won't be long, and I'm gonna need somebody to lean on, lean on me. If you need a friend, we all need somebody to lean on, lean on me. <laughs> it took him a very long time to hang up, more than expected. So just call on me, brother. If you need a friend, we all need. I feel so bad for the person in the email correspondence. I'm a bitch. At least it's not just you that gets the heat. That's true. Sometimes it feels like it. Did you tell them that, that we were deeply sorry? Do you want me to read it to you? Yeah. Yeah. No, you are good. I'm so sorry to have snapped. It's been a really stressful period of time for me, but that's no excuse for being so snippy. The call will get done. Look forward to doing it. I'm reading. It's a long message. V. Shelt. Jesus still loves me, honey. And you can't do nothing about it.
Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. service my lawnmower uh my grandson poured some of that slushy mix from the gas station down in the gas tank and i can't get it to run anymore um one of the the tires are gunned up with some cow shit or something it's like very thick and on, on the wheel and it won't spin no more so um i just need to need it service looks like the screw is corroded on there um, I used to be a lot lizard, so I have a lot I can trade for it. I don't have a lot of cash, but we can work something out in between me and you, baby. Let me know. Lori Craft. Hey, baby. Uh, this is Sue. I'm trying to get in touch with Connie. I don't know, Connie. This isn't Connie? No. Come on, Connie. I know it's you. It's me from back in Wisconsin. Thank you, honey, for the gummy bears. Hi, you've reached Connie at Corner Cut. I will be unavailable oh, until March 3rd. Please leave a message and I'll call you as soon as I can. Hey, Connie, it's Sue. Um, I was just really concerned about your dogs. When you were on vacation, I saw them eating their own shit. And I'm worried that they're going to get worms, and that's all. Um, I'm not a scammer or nothing like that, so you didn't have to be so hostile. But I forgive you. Hey, it's totally not Connie. And then the first thing in the voice went, This is Connie. They make me laugh. <laughs> Bye. Alright, this one is for Spongebob with a white heart on TikTok. It's a subscriber call. Hello? 
Hey, baby, it's Aunt Sue. Is this Cain? How can that be completed as time? Hey, Kane, this is Sue. Um, just wanted to congratulate you on your recent graduation. I was going to send you some money, but you hung up on me. So, maybe not now, but I'm still happy for you. Bye. This one is for Alexis Parsley. It is a link tree. No. I will reveal my real voice for a monster truck, baby. Thank you, Shelbyville. Hey, is this Trevor? Yeah, who's this? This is Sue. What was that little demon in the background? That scared the shit out of me. Who is it? This is Sue. Um, I'm calling about you, about your ad on Facebook for your 2023 Honda Trail Edition. Uh, yes. Um, you want 25 grand for that? Who is this? This is Sue. I'm interested in it, but does it got a gold watch that comes with it? Uh, it might have a, uh, might have a, uh, whatever you want with it. I can give about five. I'm knowing about 25. How many miles has that got on it? So we're on four distance, baby. How many miles? <laughs> I tell you what. Is this, uh, this is a famous TikToker, Sue, what's her name, Sue Zeller? Well, you know, everybody thinks that's me. I wish she would quit that shit. She is a wannabe trash. That's what that is, is a wannabe trash. I got you. That ain't me, but she wants to be me. Well, if you got cash in hand, twenty four nine ninety nine. I don't think I got that any. Maybe when my income tax come back. Maybe when your income tax come back? Yeah, I'll be in touch. Okay. Well, just, just keep me in. Keep me in mind there. You got my number. All right, baby. All right, baby. You have a good night. Bye. <laughs> I'm getting too big for my britches, honey. All right. <clears throat> A monster truck for a voice reveal? Is this my real voice or not? I don't know. Only we'll say for a monster truck. Also, if you want to call right now, send an interstellar. Send an interstellar. I know it's a lot, but I'm so booked up. I got a hundred and... How many do we have? 150. 150 orders in the queue, honey. I'm getting them done on time. 
but I cannot take any more for this live. You've got to send an interstellar if you just want me to drop what I'm doing. Lift them up. And get her done for you, honey. You didn't know I had my belly button pierced, did you? What else do you think I got pierced? Okay. Alright, this one is for Chelsea. Chelsea B04. Has been forwarded to voicemail. The person. I don't know. I don't know. Cup of nudie. I don't get it. Uh, Is this Matt? Uh, May I speak with Matt? Yeah. Um. Gary and Patsy have been blowing my phone up. Um, I live in the neighborhood. I don't know if you know who I am. Oh, yeah? You uh, know, you know Patsy? Uh, Sue. My name is Sue Dillon. Oh, okay. Yeah. They're saying that you're supposed to replace the lot. And I'm like, when the hell are they going to do that? Because uh, I'm tired of hearing about it, quite frankly. <laughs> A light pole? Yeah, yes. Yes. They said okay. every day they call and they say, you think he's going to do it today? He, no, I don't have time right now. I told them, I told Gary that I would do it when I got time. I said, there's a lot of more important things I got to get done. But I said, I could fix it. The light situation, I don't know what was go what's going on with that. Yeah. Uh, he said, you're probably just fornicating with your brother. You don't really got nothing to do. <laughs> that is valid. That's what I said, and then my son Brett, he started copying, and he, he's only 13, he's saying the word fornicating all the time now. Oh my gosh, Gary said that? Yep. What the heck? I know. I don't know, I don't know, I'm not, I'm not worried about it. So, I, I told Gary, because Gary's the one to come up and talk to me about it, and I had no idea nothing about these lights. Joe Wilhelm's the only one I ever knew about these lights is I fixed that light right there on my corner and I fixed a couple of them down there and he was talking about he had it he was paying or something and the next thing I know Gary come up and talked to me saying something about it nobody was pitching in and it was costing so much money and I was like well I don't know nothing about none of this I have no idea I moved here in 2020 and Joe Wilhelm's the only one that's ever talked to me about these lights yeah you know what yeah. though they're nuts they're just mad they're always wanting me to swing with them. And I'm like, no, honey, we are in a closed marriage. Joe? No, Gary. Oh, Gary. Not oh. Joe. Yeah, yeah, so I don't know about him. I don't no, either. I don't know. I don't either. I just had to tell you because I don't like talking behind people's back. I hear you. <laughs> I hear you. I didn't, I don't know. And he, he came up and talked to me. Well, he came up a couple times to me and talked to me about it and that's when I was like, Gary, I said, I don't know. I said, this light deal, I said, I when I first moved in here, Joe, uh, I told him what I did. I said, I did electric work. And he said, well, you think you could fix it? You don't have to pitch in or something, you know, if everybody's doing whatever. I said, just keep it nice. He was trying to keep them on or whatever. Then the next thing I know, Gary moved in or something. And then he come up and asked me about it two or three times. And I said, well, I I said, I ain't worried about it. I said, oh, when I get time, I said, I'll, I'll run a line down there or do whatever I want, you know, need to do just to get that light turned, that light pole turned on. I said, that's fine. I said, I don't blame anybody that's, if they're paying a bunch of money to, you know, and nobody's helping or whatever. I said, I'll help or whatever's going on. And he said, well, nobody, he said, I'm, I'm wiping my hands clean. The last time I talked to him, he said, I'm wiping my hands clean of it. He said, I've made everybody mad or something like that. And that's it. And I'm like, well, I said, oh. 
They're just whatever, starting straight whatever, shit. Whatever, you know, I, I, whatever, I don't know. They're just said, starting I'm, straight shit, and then he just ignore them. They're what? Starting straight shit, honey. Oh, I got you. That, that's his type of people, huh? It is. I just had to tell you, but, you know, I'll uh, keep you updated, honey. <laughs> yeah. Well, I appreciate the, the All right. info. All right, so, well, you take care, sweet pea. Okay, you too, soon. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Can y'all stop pinning shit? I'm trying to find something. Thank you guys for all of those gifts, Brett. That was amazing. Thank you for the interstellars. I'm trying to find the other person that sent an interstellar so that I can DM them because I didn't reset my goal when they sent it. Now I don't know who sent it. But I'm going to find them. He was so nice, that poor man. There's drama. Brett, the lion for me. Thank you, baby. Who sent the inter the second interstellar? I can't find it. Let make yourself known mods. Please pin the second interstellar sender so I can friend them and get the get the info for the call. Shell Bell, but I need you to pin her profile. Shell Bell, okay. Thank you, Brett. Thank you. Y'all are so sweet. Thank you, Annika. Oh, thank you for that. Shell Bill, I'm following you back. Go ahead and send me your request. Oh, wow. Thank you, Brett. I'm just setting up a new goal. I'm sorry. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you, Xander. I'm going to look at it right now. Okay, this is my real voice, and this is when this is all you're gonna get. So take it now, but don't tell people that this is my real voice. We gotta keep the facade going. It's just between me and y'all. It's our inside secret. Okay. Anyway. Hold on.
I'm trying to figure something out. Just give me a second. Oh, Xander. Send me your request, baby. Oh, thank you, Hunter. Xander, I'm so sorry that you didn't get any recognition for the clappers on the live fest. I guarantee you. Oh, thank you, Fred. Um, I'm just saying, I, I recognize it. I'm sorry you didn't get thanked enough. But let's do your request. Would you rather be thanked enough or spanked enough? Thank you, Brett. Thanks, Daddy Brett. Everybody drop the sticker. Please leave your message for... ...cannot be completed at... ...all cannot be completed at style. Why the hell not? Oh, wait, that's the wrong gift goal. <laughs> Thank you, Annika. That's beautiful. gonna leave a message Xander if she calls back I'll get her tomorrow hey um, I'm trying to reach Erica this is Sue Dillon from the school systems um, and I'm getting in touch with you about Ariel and Anna I know they were recently suspended and their suspension is supposed to end tomorrow but honey we got a crank call from them and they said Nana Nana Boo Boo stick your head in doo doo and so we are extending the suspension another day. I'm sorry to do this to you, but we have to. It's policy. Call me back. Pam, you're doing too much, honey. Thank you. Thank you, Pam. Pamela. All right. Xander, again, thank you for everything, baby. I'm happy to be here for you. Oh, thank you, Brett. All these love notes. Okay, she'll bill. May I speak with Jeff? This is he. <clears throat> Jeff, um, the interlock you installed is, is malfunctioning. Is what? It is malfunctioning. What's it doing? It went off on me. It messed up my damn buzz. It, it messed up your motor? No, it messed up my buzz. Last week. What's your name? Sue. 
At your place. Which which place? At your words. I don't remember, honey. I'm an alcoholic. So 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 what's wrong with the, what's wrong with the interlock? I I break I drank a shot of tequila, breathed into it, and it took my buzz away. Okay. I ain't even drunk no more. Is that normal? You sound uh, you sound like you're constipated, honey. Are you good? No, I'm I'm fine. Um, I'm just a little confused about this call. I'm tr I'm trying to figure out what. Here's here's what I'm wondering. What what do you need from me? I just wanted to know why it's malfunctioning. So you said it's it's malfunctioning. You said it took your buzz away. It most certainly did. Okay. Um. I I, I don't I don't know you. Can you call me tomorrow when I'm at work? Absolutely, honey. Okay, yeah, call me tomorrow and we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. All Maybe right? you'll take a good shit between now and then, too, and you'll be feeling better. All right. That sounds good. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye, honey. All right, bye. Thank you for a good one, Shelbel. Yep. All right, this one yep. is for Diane Turkios. Yep. Hey, can you do me a favor? What? Can you go on IG and do a story video of yourself saying, Sue cannot go live on this app. They keep messing her up. Go to TikTok. I don't have access to your IG. It's on my iPad. Oh. Video of yourself out there. Oh, I was Hi, you've reached Amy. I can answer the phone right fine. now. Can you leave me a message? Thank you, Brett. That was majestic. Oaks neighborhood, and I have some complaints to file. Sue? Yeah, yes. Why does it come through coming up? Not that it's any of your damn business, but that's what. Talking nicely if you're going to call me? Just because you're the president of the HOA, I don't mean you can boss me around. I'm not bossing you around. I asked you why you were calling from Nashville, Tennessee, and I am not the president of the HOA. What are you then? Well, I am the treasurer of the Civic Club. But Sue, where do you live in in Whispering Oaks? And how? Why do you call me bossing you around? What if I said that was bossy? You're completely bossy. Everything. Uh, do you think that you're being ugly? No, I'm beautiful. You're treating me in, in improperly. You're treating me improperly by fining me for trash and recycling when people are walking their dogs in my yard and letting them shit. The priorities are strung out of whack. Where in Whispering Oaks do you live, ma'am? I don't feel comfortable to say. I don't feel comfortable talking to you right now. If you have a complaint, please list it with the HOA and I will respond accordingly. Honey, I'm going through the heat of menopause right now and I'm doing my best. You well, look I, older I, than I me. I appreciate that. And you continue to do your best. And I do not try and call me again without first... Don't tell me what to do. Uh, okay, bye. 
Bye. I would never survive in an HOA. Thank you, Brett. Thank you, honey. All right, Noel Webb. If you want to know if this is my real voice, send a monster truck and I'll reveal it. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone... Hello, is this Zeke? Is this what? Is this Zeke? Yeah. This is Sarah. I'm with the Traffic Stop um, community. Um, we recently clocked you going 70 and a 50, and so we're going to have a ticket sent to you. Hold on a second. Hold on. Here's my supervisor. I was just filling in for her. <clears throat> Hi, honey. It's Sue. Um, we're gonna have to give you a speeding ticket. We clocked you going 70 and a 50 on the camera. Uh, where at? It was, you know, you should know where you were speeding. You should be more of a responsible driver than that. Yeah, you're right. You got me there. Thank you. <laughs> Is this a good mailing address to send the ticket to? Oh, uh, what's, what's the address? Uh, uh, God, excuse me. I'm I'm going to have to. I'm about to throw up because this job is very stressful. Yeah, I, I can see that. I'll call you back later. All right. I love you, honey. Mm -hmm. Okay, Stephanie. Um, gonna borrow Pimentel. That's a tongue twister. Fortunately, we cannot connect your call. Uh, Thank you, Brett. That was real cute. You can't convince me that Brett ain't like the CEO under the CEO of TikTok Live or something. And he's just testing all the gifts on my life. And just making sure they work. Thank y'all for the roses, honey. It does not go unnoticed. Hi, thank you for calling, and please leave me your voicemail.
Hi, um, is this Alexandria? Hello? Hello, may I speak with Alexandria? Can you hear me? Alexandria, this is Sue. Uh, I am calling because she just hung up on me when I called her. I'm gonna call one more. This is never what I do, but I'm gonna call one more time. Alexandria, this is Sue. I'm dating your uncle, and I'm concerned about him because he's been shitting in the yards at night, and I just want to know what I need to do. And it's nice to meet you, by the way. Bye. Thank you, Kate. Kate with the money gun. Adam Danette. This is Stacy. Thank you for calling, and I'm so sorry I missed your call. Please leave a message, and I'll call you back as soon as possible. Thank you. Thank you, Nurse Jim. Thank you, Brett. Thank you, Michelle. Thank you guys so much. Hi, this is Stacy. Thank you for calling and I'm so sorry I missed your call. Please leave a message and I'll call you back as soon as possible. Thank you. The mailbox is full and cannot accept any messages. One more time. Hey, 
Hey, Stacy, how are you doing? I'm fine. It's Sue from church. Um, I just needed to talk to somebody because I got something and I'm in a serious pickle right now. Miss Sue, I don't think I know you. Yeah, not a lot of people know about me. I try to stay on the DL, but I've heard really nice things about you, so... Okay, this is Sue. This is Faith. I'm, I'm sorry. I can't accept this call, okay? What? Well, this must be told or somebody doing a uh, prank call, right? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. I wish it was. Yes, it is. <laughs> no. I'm worried about this kind of voice. Okay, is it Parker or Cole? I don't know, honey. I'm just calling. Oh, you know what? It's the way I hate this guy. I'm just calling because I've been sleeping with the preacher and I don't know what to do. <laughs> oh, oh my God. Shit. Fanny, a.k.a. Fallon. This is a sub call. This is a part of my merch that you can get 15% off today. Leave your message for Jay Carter. Hi, honey. This is Sue from Walmart Corporate. Um, we have noticed that you have been taking home buggies from the parking lot, and we will be deducting this from your pay. Buggies cost $500 per cart, so um, that will be... Rob. Jesus Christ. <coughs> Jesus Christ. Wow, Brett. Oh, again, you knocked it out of the park. I've never seen a Zeus. Thank you, Sweet Pea, for showing me the finer things in life. Thank you, Samantha. All right, Nick DeWitt. This is a prank order, Mom. It looks like it isn't, but it is. Can you mark it as complete in link or in uh? What's the word? Stop the lie. Fortunately, it's not fortunate. Every time I dial a number that's out of out of the U.S., it says. Fortunately, we cannot connect you. It's not fortunate. It's not. Thank you, Brett. You know what, Brett? If you send a Rosa Nebula, you'll own that gift, too. You probably own all the gifts. Hey, who am I? <laughs> Thank you, Brett. <coughs> 
He's amazing. Can you give me the charger cord for this? I don't know where it is. Not bad. It's not going to reach. I need the one that plugs into my computer that plugs in there. Can you hear me okay? Yes. Is this Lola? Oh my god, is this you? Yes, honey. I had to wish you a happy birthday, honey. Thank you so much. You're welcome. How old did you turn? I'm turning 21. Oh, this is going to be a, well, it's a Sunday, but I hope you're still going to have a good time. Thank you. I'm watching your live right now. Oh, I'm honored for to be your entertainment for your birthday night. Yeah, I'm sorry my dad didn't pick up. He's so convinced you're a scammer. Oh, honey, that's okay. I am basically a scammer, aren't I? <laughs> well, everybody wish Lola a happy birthday in the chat. She's watching right now. Well, honey. Oh, well, thank you so much for calling me, Sue. Anytime. Happy birthday. Thank you. Have a good night. Bye, sweet pea. Oh. What a sweetheart. Birthday girl. One time for the birthday biatch. This one is for Aiden Flores. Wow. Was being forwarded. I love the Rosa Nebula. Thank you, Brett. I was just kidding, but thank you. <laughs> That's amazing. Hello. Hey, how are you doing, honey? It's Aunt Sue. I'm doing real good. How about yourself? I'm all right. I just need somewhere to squat tonight. You got any room on your couch? Um, who is this? Sue. Um, hold on. Brett, you know you got like 10 prank calls to redeem, right? Brett won... The competition during live fest for a year's supply of free calls. being forwarded to voicemail the person you're trying to reach is not available at the time please record just mark whichever one complete that you need to mom and we'll just mark the other one when we do it complete well, i'll just take a mental note of that your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system two i'm gonna leave a message At 
the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hi, honey. Um, is it cut off? So can you call me back? I really need somewhere to sleep tonight. Bye, honey. Thank you for the pool party, Brett. Bye! <laughs> Jacob, um, you're triggering my stress because... I absolutely 100% will not see your message. I will not read the DM for anybody. If you don't follow me, I will not see If I'm not friends with you, I will not see it. I will not make any exceptions for nobody. Jesus Christ himself could message me, and I wouldn't follow him, and I wouldn't see his message. You don't follow Christ. I don't think he has a TikTok yet. Aaron Ashley. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record. We should have Daddy Brett on Sue's shit show because I interview people on there if he would be willing. Hello? Hey. Um, may I speak with Jessica? Jessica. This isn't Jessica? No. I really needed to speak with you, Jessica. I have a serious situation going on. Your your husband keeps pissing on my plants in my yard. And every time I come out to run him off, he's obsessed with my titties. Well, maybe he likes them. I, I don't blame him, but I don't like it. I don't like the titties. Well, I don't, I mean, I don't know what to tell you. We just need, so you are Jessica. No. I know you but are. I, mean, I know please. you are. You said you're calling the police? I said please. Oh, I was like, that's a waste of resources, honey. I ain't calling no damn police. I wouldn't either. Can I ask who you are? My name is Sue. Sue? Well, I'll tell you what, Sue. Next time you go out there with your titties out taking whatever you're doing, why don't you try and lure my husband over there? Okay. All right. All right. Well, I'll talk to you later. Okay. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. What the hell game is she playing? What kind of psycho game is she playing with me? Playing me for a damn fool. I'm sorry, but I'm freaking out right now. I'm freaking out right now because my friend Chelsea Lynn just texted me. I'm going to her show tomorrow. I'm so excited. She invited me and Spanky, and she's going to speak with us before or after. And she just texted my phone and said, she texted me and said, the whole crew is freaking out that you're coming tomorrow. Are you effing kidding me? I'm freaking out that I'm even getting to go. Are you serious? I'm about to, I'm like, I'm out of my body right now, so just let me come back down to earth. Humble flex, but hell, I'm flattered as hell. I can't wait to see her. Alright, let's get back to work. <clears throat> let me just text, I can't leave the queen. I gotta text her real quick. <laughs> Frankie said I was gonna speak. I love that video where Chelsea Lynn's like, if you have a problem with this flag, get out and it's the Whataburger. Flag. That was the best video. So good. <laughs> oh, I couldn't agree more, dude. If you get a problem with this flag, I'll help you pack. She doesn't love 
funny videos. Celebrate Boom Girl, come on. Okay, now back to business. Sorry. Thank you, Britt. Nobody needs to be worried about Britt. Okay, he's good. We check in with Britt. Britt is just a wealthy, wealthy daddy. Let him be what he is. Did you hear that crack in my neck? My crack. Mom said she'd be she'd hate for you to get sick and not let not get to go. She's made some special brownies if 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 you want to come pick them up. Oh, that way she can take your spot. Thank you, Brit. Jealousy doesn't look good on you, Brenda. <laughs> okay, this one is for um, TY042417. <clears throat> hey Tim, how are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm good. Um, I just had something to report to you. We rent from you out here in Southern Grace Trailer Park in Ashford. Hey, what, what'd you say now? I'm sorry. We rent from you in Southern Grace Trailer Park in Ashford. Yes, ma'am. And um, Spunky was smoking a cigarette in bed after we had just done the nasty and, um, he, you know, like, lifted his hand back and burned a damn hole in the wall. Um, I'm sorry about this. Um, what can we do? I'll have to get somebody out there to look at it tomorrow and to see what it's going to cost to get it fixed. Oh, crap. Could I just give someone a BJ and we can call it a day? <laughs> So. Well, if you change your mind or somebody's in need, let me know, because I'm a wall lizard. That don't bother me none. <laughs> I understand that. What trailer are you in? 509. And what now? I'm in trailer 509. 509? Yeah. Now, they usually have a num like two numbers and then a letter. Oh, Spanky, what is it? Bravo 69. B69. That's what it is. I'm thinking of the last place we were at. Yeah. And what's your name again? Sue. What's the name of the, the who's on the lease? Spanky. Spanky? Yes. Okay, do you go on the first or the second uh, driveway? Should be the second driveway. Okay. So it's by the greenhouse? Yes. Okay. Are you in the blue trailer right there? Um... Well, I don't, I'm colorblind, honey. I don't know what color. Okay. All right. All right. Well, I'll, I'll uh, and it's under Spanky. Is the, who's the renter? Yes, and don't be alarmed if you look in the toilet. The commode has been stopped up for two weeks. Have you told anybody? No. I'm embarrassed yeah. by it. Yeah, y'all got to tell somebody about that. You know, you've got to let that smoke. It's because Spanky drank some milk, and he knows he's not supposed to do that. Yeah. 
All right, let me uh, let me get the uh, maintenance people and let them know so they get out there and look at it. Okay, baby. Thank right. you. Thank you. Thank you both. Yeah. Tell him now that it's a joke. Tell him now. Please. Please. Please tell him it's not real. Look, she just sent me this. Hold on, let me turn it up. Let me turn it up. She sent me a video of them reacting to me coming tomorrow. Hey, 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 what are you doing? Hang on, there you go. Oh, you. <laughs> I thought she does it for so long. <laughs> I'm like, what freaking world am I living in? Okay. I said I got that callous throat, honey. Spanky's been warming it up for our whole marriage. Okay, this one is for Alec Frost. I got a big zit. Menopause, honey. Am I in the rankings? No shit. Trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record. Hold up, I gotta text my agent. This I sell it in my merch, honey. to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hello, John. This is Sue. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if you remember me, but back in the day, <clears throat> excuse me, honey, I just got done with a job. I'm a lot lizard and it's gummed up in my throat, but um, I am Mary Beth McLean's sister, and um, I just wanted you to know that, and um, we know that you went off for several flings in Mexico, 
when you were dating Heidi, and I just have a lot of questions to ask you. You know, I don't judge. It's a lot lizard, but... And I was wanting to see if you need anything from me, because I do services for $50 and up. So just let me know. Bye. I don't know if it ships to Australia. It should be international shipping. Um, if you can't figure it out, you can always message the lady. Um, well, you can message the comedy outlet. That is what I sell through, and you'll see it on my, my link tree when you click on the site. Thank you for the TikTok universe. Just dropping it like it's nothing. Daddy Brett in the house. Everybody dropped the Daddy Brett sticker. Casual. So casual. So casually just dropped to the universe. Brett. Thank you. I cannot deal with this dopamine high. I feel like I'm in a manic episode right now. Your call cannot be... Thank you, Brad. It is really beautiful for everyone to see, and we appreciate it. Thank you so much, Taylor. Thank you, Moots. My husband's name is Spanky, a.k.a. Taylor. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice message. I'm going to cry because I've been such a Beyonce today. I don't deserve any of this. You're but I appreciate it. This one is fourth. Hey, honey. Um, is this Mary? This is Sue. I'm a neighbor of yours. Um, I live down the road from you. I live across the street from the high school. My house is the beige, neutral colored house. Hey. Hey. Um, you know, I just, I, I'm not trying to be rude, but your brown dog with the black face has been shitting in my yard. Um, my dog hasn't been out. It's been out and about for the past few weeks and it likes to come to my yard and take a shit. Which dog again? The ba no, sorry, the it's got the black face, it's the brown dog. And it's been in your yard? Yes, ma'am. Huh. So, um and I'm if not you sure could send your, possible. if you could send your husband to clean it up, that would be great because I've got an abscess on my ass crack right now and I can't get up and bend over or it pops. And I just can't be picking up dog shit that don't belong to me. Yeah, I don't think it might be our dog because we don't have a collar or a leash to take her out. I know that's and why she comes on her own and shits. I don't think that's possible. Can I ask how you got my number? Um, I got it from Nigel. Who's Nigel? My friend. He does, like, a lot of background checks on people, and he was able to pull it up real quick for me. They say there's Sue. They live in the beige house down the street. I have videos of my dog in my backyard every single day. My dog does not leave my backyard. Oh, do you have videos of it 24-7? That would be really freaky. I mean, the dog walks in my backyard. My wife stays at home. No one leaves my house. I'm telling you, honey. My dog was down there pooping in your yard. I'm telling you, honey. It's been escaping and taking a shit in mine. Why would I make this up? 
All right, so if you have video of my dog and pictures of my dog pooping in your yard, that'd be nice. Because <laughs> I'm telling you right now, it didn't happen. Pull the videos up and do a go, go from there. I don't take orders. Okay. Some title to go on there. Okay, y'all, I can't do any more Interstellars for kids I'm behind, but let's make a gift goal just because we're on the rankings. Let's do some money guns. Thank you for the money guns, guys. Thank you, Christina. Hey, Allison, how can I help you? Hey, Allison. Um, <clears throat> I just have a confession to make. I messed something up in your salon, the Lotus Beauty Loft. Um, I was there getting my hair did, and I went to the bathroom, and I did flush a condom, and I'm pretty sure I messed up your plumbing because um, it wouldn't go down when I left. Oh. And it was, oh, goodness. When were you in? Um, it was on Friday. Okay. I'm sorry. And what was your name? My name is Sue. Okay, Sue. So, what, do you, what would you like us to do about that? Well, if if the toilet is still acting up, let me know. I well, didn't. We don't call it a toilet. We call it a toilet. Well, if the toilet's still messed up, let me know. The commode, whatever the shitter. If it's messed up, let me know, and I'll pay for it. Can I ask you what you were doing with the condom in our bathroom of the salon? I just want to make sure none of the girls are acting inappropriate with you. Well, I'm a woman, so I didn't have nothing to attach it to. It was just old, and I thought. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, I had been working that day, and I just threw it away. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay. Well, I work tomorrow, so I'm going to check the toilet and see if there's any condom stuff up in there. Thank you, baby. I'm sorry. That's I, okay. It Do happens. you have your contact information in case they have to call a plumber to bill you? Just call the cell phone number. It's fine. All right. Thank you, Sue. Bye. Bye-bye, honey. The toilet. Thank you, Math Josh. Thank you for the money gun, honey. Alyssa East 38. Hello, is this Jameson? Oh, God. What? I know it's a prank call. Dude, no it's not. Who are you to say that I'm prank calling you when I have something serious to talk about? Because uh, my, friend my friend had the same thing come up. What? Are I'm you... I'm trying to ask away. Are you drinking on a Sunday, honey? No, I wish. You sound slurred. I'm just really high. Oh, okay. What'd you smoke? Crack. No THC. Okay. Stay away from crack, okay? No, no, that one. Okay. All right, honey. Nighty night. Have a brownie and go to sleep. Okay. Good night, baby. Could you imagine hearing me oh, in that state? No. Probably made me freak out. Freak out. Sarah Steele. Oh, thank you, Cody. Y'all are the best.
Okay. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Um, this one is for Sarah Steele. Thank you, Brett. Thank you, Jenny. I saw it. My mama texted me the mistake with the last name. I'll do my best to make sure it's done right. Your call has been forwarded to an automated... I wonder what the record is for the most roses sent in one live stream. Does anyone know? Because we should try to beat it tonight. Well, who's this? This is Dave. This is Sue. I'm trying to get in touch with David. I'm sorry, who, who are you? Sue. Um, I'm a neighbor of yours, and I'm wondering when you're going to pull the weeds. They're very overgrown in your yard, and I'm president of the HOA, so... Uh... Which, uh, you're, you're a neighbor? Which, which property um, are you referring to? Um, excuse me, why are you questioning me? No, I, I'm just, because I, I mean, I, I wasn't aware of any weeds growing in. I mean, I actually, I, I live in Virginia, and I noticed you have a Tennessee number. Yeah, right. I do. I live in Virginia as well. Don't judge a book by its cover, honey. Oh, no, that's, yeah, I mean, if you if you do live in the neighborhood, I'm just making sure are you talking about the correct property? Because yes, what, 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 which address is it? I don't like to say it over the phone because you know the the government is listening to me. I'm running for presidential candidate of the United <laughs> States of America for 2024, and they have my phone tapped. You know, Trump is after everybody but himself, so I can't say it over the phone. But I know you know where I live, and I'm just trying to get the neighborhood cleaned up as on. Well, all right. Well, then I'll make sure to remove my weeds then. Thank you, baby. All right. Well, you have a good day. All right. All right. Bye. I honestly don't think Terry Joe has the record for the most roses sent. I think that is weird to say. I think someone has intentionally tried to beat the record. And I don't think Terry Joe gives a flying shit about the roses. Um, I want to know what it is because it would be fun to beat it. And I think I could. Because I am that MF and bitch, honey. Don't think twice about it. They don't know who they talk to. They don't know who I am. The wireless customer you called is not... Thank you guys for the roses. The wireless customer you called is not available at this time. Please try your call again later. Announcement one. The okay, will you email Alyssa East 38 Mama and say it wouldn't work and send us an alternate? Thank you guys for the roses. Thank you, honey. I need a moment. I'm like, my brain is fried. I've been doing these calls all day. Not that it, I'm not trying to whine. I'm just saying that's why I'm being a little slow and I'm sorry. I did 42 cameos earlier. And then I did about 10 other calls after that. No, I didn't see the big gift. What was it?
What was it? I'm so sorry I missed it. Thank you. Whatever it was, thank you. Thank you, Brett. Thank you, Holly Rob. Okay. Freak out. Thank you, Brett. Freak out. Okay, Emmons John, I gotta read this long ass message. <clears throat> Just know, if you send me a long-ass message, this is going to be really bitchy, so take it with a grain of salt, but when you send me a long-ass description for the prank call, it really ticks me off. It really does. But I'll do it. I know it's super long. It's, it's just really frustrating. But I get it. You know, you're going to give me the details. I get it. Thank you for the hat. Thank you, Brett. Thank you, Adam. Okay, we can do this. Thank you, Brett. Uh, do you want me to get you dinner or anything? Or are you good? I'm good, baby. Thank you for the money gun, <laughs> Steph and Rob. Me with the money gun. Thank you, Brett and Adam. Wow, Brett's at 677. 79. Thank you, Icy, for the cycling one. That was pretty. Thank you, Brett. Thank you, Steph and Rob. Brett's still going. Thank you, Savvy. This is Sue. Um, I was riding horse on your property, and um, I um, your nurse let me in the house. I'm sorry, I'm very itchy because I got some chiggers out in your field. But let me in your house, and I stopped up your commode. So I apologize. I really blew up the porcelain too. It's like splashed all up on the wall, and I tried to wipe it off, but you didn't really have much stuff down there um to clean it so you probably should disinfect that i felt very claustrophobic in the bathroom i just wanted to give you some tips it was really ugly down there and i really think with as big of a house you have and as much money you have you should really hike it up and do better than that um, you could are you single because i'm happy to come in and help and, and maybe we could go out on a date or something i don't know um you call me back In Buchanan style. <phone rings> yes, I can call anywhere in the world, honey. Just let me know where I'm calling so I can do the right country code. Yes, I can call Hawaii. That's in the U.S. Hello. 
thank you, Icy. Sweet pea. That's so sweet of you. I can't call other planets yet, but I can call anywhere around the world. I mean, all with this Nokia and this rotary. Thank you, Brett. Thank you guys for them roses. Damn, Brett burned himself out. I know that finger's gotta be cramping up. Oh, thank you, Steph and Rob. Yeah, I will take no disrespect to Brett in the chat. If I see any disrespect to Brett, my moderators will ban you, and you will never see me again. And I stand by that. We stand on business. We don't disrespect Daddy. All cannot be completed as dialed. Please check the number and dial again. Announcement for. What ranking are we? Are we still in the rankings? Fifty six. That's pretty good. Thank you, Becky. Thank you, Aaron. 55. Oh, thank you, Brett. You know, you gotta take stuff like this with a grain of salt, though. We know that we're doing it authentically, but a lot of them people in the... Hello, this is Holly at Dr. Warren Austin's office. If this is a medical emergency, please hang up and dial 911. I am momentarily away from the phone or on the other line. Please leave a message and I will tur return your call shortly. Thank you. Bye-bye. Hey, honey, this is Sue. Um, I am just really excited about our cruise in May. Um, I've never spoke with you, so I just want to introduce myself. My name is Sue, and I'm a lot lizard, and I met somebody through, I was servicing her husband. She don't care. She's in an open relationship, but anyway, um, they invited me on the trip, and I cannot wait. I'm going to, you know, drinks are on me. I'm smuggling in some devil's lettuce for us, too, and I just can't wait. So, have a blessed day. All I'm going to say is I don't mean any disrespect to TikTok at all. I love TikTok. I do a lot on here. I couldn't have as much success without it. But <clears throat> I'm so proud of us to get to the rankings because we do it authentically. And that's what I'm going to say. And that's all I'm going to say. Period. Okay, Becca Baker, 5696. Hey, is this Sherry? Uh, no, who's calling? This is Sue. I need to speak with Sherry. Sue? Yeah, yes. Who's Sue? I'm Sue Dillon. I'm a neighbor of yours. Um, there's been a cat coming from your house on Milan. Um, where, 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 are you, where are you at? What, what neighbor? I'm to your left. Stinson Street, a few houses down. You talking about all the way on the end of new house, or? Yes. You talking about, uh, I'm not sure which way you're talking. Uh, well, the point of the matter is, is that your cat's been coming down here and shitting on my flower beds. Oh, okay, I'm sorry, um, uh, which house are you? Uh, 
I'm the house on Stanson Street a few houses down. I know, but there's which way? The left. Well, the left. Which left? I'm mean, out. Your I'm left. Stanson Street from my house or from Stanson yes, Street? From your house. From your house, baby. Are you out in your driveway now? Or? No, not right now. I'm not home right now. I'm taking care of some business. Okay, I'm at seven nine eight nine. Hey, yeah, I know if where you, you are. Go, are you? Are you talking about if you go towards the U-Haul place or the other yes, way? Yes, the U-Haul. Okay, are you the house right next to me or the one on down? The one on down, baby. Where the black man lives? No. What? There's only two houses. I live beside him. I live beside him. Huh? I live beside him. Who, who is him? Which one are you talking about? The one you were just speaking of. Um, but can you get isn't your... There, isn't there a black man that lives there? I don't know, honey. I don't see color. What? Um, I'm just trying to get an idea. I don't see color either. I'm just trying to get an idea what house we're talking about. Um. Anyway, your cat's been shitting in my yard. Are you sure it's my cat? Yes. What color is it? I don't see color, honey. I don't remember. Give me a fucking break. Now, come on. Now, what? Yeah, come on. Let's just quit that being like that. Now, what color is the cat? I Talk am I am a Democrat, and I will not stand what? for this. This is ridiculous. I'm trying to, I'm trying to find out what's this going on. This hostility you have yeah. towards the man... That lives beside me. That is wrong of you. He is a man. I'm trying to figure out which house you're talking about. You I could mean, have said he was well, tall. Well, you know. I'm home right now. Did it just happen? It's been happening all week. That's not my cat. It is. My cat's been inside all week. We've been out of town. I don't know. So, it's been all last so, week too. It's been so, it's been all month. Maybe honey. maybe you need to get. Your back's straight. My maybe back is to, very maybe straight. You need to be a little more open about your what's going on. I have open heart, you open legs, open mind, honey. You're the one that's closed minded, not me. I have open but everything. You know what you're talking about. I know what I'm talking about, honey. I'm a smart woman. Well, you're not answering my questions. I'm what answering. Color is the damn cat? Orange and white, damn it. Okay, that's not my cat. Yes, it is. No, it's not. I wasn't born yesterday. I see that catwalk on your property when it comes to mine. That cat's been on inside all week. Lies after lies after lies after lies after lies after lies. Okay, so... Now you call me a liar. I didn't say you're a liar. I said lies after lies after lies after lies after lies after... You better calm, you need to just kind of calm down a little bit. I'm calm, honey. My heart rate's 69. I'm doing just fine. Okay, well, we'll talk to you later. All right. He sees color. Thank you so much for all them roses, Brett. That was crazy. And thank you, Nurse Marks. And thank you, Uber. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Brett. You're so sweet. <clears throat> Thank you, Michelle. <phone rings> what number are we now? Is this Kathy? Yes. Hey, Kathy. Um, did Dwight tell you he invited me over for supper tomorrow? He did not. Um, would you, is there anything that you want me to bring? Who am I speaking to? Sue. 
Um, he said that we were going to talk about us, um, me joining in your relationship. Well, I think this has to be a joke or you've got the wrong number. He said y'all were looking to spice things up. All right. Well, I'll uh, talk to him about that. And, uh, yeah, I just had a knee replacement surgery, so I am certainly not the person that needs to spice anything up right now. Okay, well, you... She told him about that. What? She said, I told him about that. What have they said? I didn't know that. Oh, God. I don't... It's not funny when it's real, you know? But... Huh? She just said, I told him about that. I just had a knee replacement surgery. Thank you, Brett. This one is for Lib Speech. I'm sorry if I'm not saying the name. I'm trying to. Thank you, Brett. Thank you, Lord Farquaad. Nice to see you here. It's, is it the real Lord Farquaad? Thank you, Brett. Is that really you, Lord Farquaad? Yes, give Brett a follow, y'all. He is great. lift tomorrow. <laughs> Ooh, that sounds like it's major. It is. I'm so excited. Are you going to have some help for that? Oh, yes. Thank he's ready. He's so excited about it. Is he? he is really he going to be, is. like, just, like, holding them for you? And... Oh, yes. And, you know, he was worried that I wouldn't be able to keep the, keep the piercings, but we can, so he's even more <gasps> stoked. Do they have to take them out before they do the surgery, or do they just leave them in there? They're just leaving them in there. Do they? Yeah. Wow. I had to put the little ones in. I took the dangly ones out, but yeah, they're going to leave them in. Yeah. So how high are you going to bring them babies up? Oh, honey, it ain't. You ain't even going to think. It's just going to sit real pretty, real up at like, I don't know, it's going to be like a bullseye. A bullseye. You know, you got to be careful because I've heard stories about they mix nipples up. When they do that, sometimes they, like, they have so many nipples in the, when you're getting oh. surgery, and then they, I'll, you make sure they give you yours back. I'll make sure I put, like, a mark on it or something. I'll put a blue oh, mark yeah. on them. Put a little tra a tracker of some sort, maybe, in there. Yes, and then they're, yeah. and they're peers, so those, they should know. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Well, it was a pleasure talking to you. Oh, you too. I love you. I love you. I love you. I even know. Who called? I mean, I know why you called me. Why? So, well, I know. I bet my friend Lib called, put you up to it. She may or may not have. You know, I don't. <laughs> I love you so much. This made my day. I love you too, sweet pea. Okay, bye. 
the... Oh, you know, I don't usually save calls where people know who I am, but that one was fun. <clears throat> okay, Alyssa East, 38. Wait, this is the one I already tried and it wasn't working. This one is for, that one is not getting done. I'm sorry. Thank you, Holly. Um, yeah, sorry, Mom. This one is Mom Hall Sophie Messina. We are so close to making Virginia slim again and finishing up the money gun. Hey, honey, how are you doing? Is this Angie? Is this Angie? Angie, it's me, Sue. It's me, Sue. We went to high school together at Hatboro. Do you remember me? No. Um, well, I remember you, and I have a confession to make. I just left my husband for you because I've been sexually attracted to you for a very long time. Stop calling my number. Okay, I didn't know if you meant to hang up or not. I just, I'm sorry. I just had to tell you. It's hard being that hot. She knows it. Thank you, Holly GJ. Thank y'all for helping me meet my goal. And I really appreciate it, y'all. What can we do? I really like them pink dream cars. I might do a couple of them. Because those are really pretty and I want y'all to see. Ooh, I've never seen a star adventure. Let's do that. Or maybe I have, and it's just... Okay, DMS Curl Girl. Curly Girl. Hey, Greg, how are you doing? Just fine. Are you delivering the mail tomorrow? Yes. You should come inside for a coffee, honey. I'd love to sit and pick your brain. <coughs> um, okay, who is this? This is Sue. Sue. Yes. Sue who? Sue Dillon. Um, I, you deliver my mail, and I, I'm gonna be real honest with you, you catch my eye every day. I look at you with my binoculars through the window. I think you're very handsome. Well, thank you very much, but I'm married. I never could see a ring, but, you know, I couldn't get a good angle. But I, pre I, I respect that, you know, but you should know that you are sexy. Well, I thank you for that. You're very welcome, honey. Well, you take care. Bye. Bye-bye. He should know, you know, we gotta tell people these things. Did they 
you're sexy. Oh, thank you, Jacqueline. Is that what that is? Oh, that's so cute. That's so cute. Thank you for the aquarium. Um, what should we do? Let's do... Shit. Let's just do heart puffs. I don't know. Okay. Next up is Michelle Sprinkle. Oh, wait, we've already done this one. She sent me a, what was the gift going in a filler? And we already did hers, so we're skipping her. Um, let's do Stephanie Trude. Oh, yay, we hit a million likes, and we got the heart hole. Thank you. Hey, baby, how you doing? This is Sue. Man, your voice sure is handsome. Thank you, honey. Please leave your message for three. Thank you, Brett. Please leave your message. message for I'm gonna leave a message thank you honey hi honey it's Sue I'm trying to get in touch with Samantha um I know you just had a baby and I really want to come hold it if that's okay um I'm your cousin I'm your third cousin I saw some pictures of the baby on Facebook and it's just beautiful and I'm in the area and if I could just stay the night tomorrow and I can hold your baby, that'd make my night. Um, just tell me back when you can. Thank you for that gift, honey. CR Bates 062. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you, Winnie Talk. Y'all are so giving. Thank you, Steph and Rob. Hello. Hey, baby. Is this Reagan? <gasps> it is. This is Reagan. Hi, baby. How are you doing? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm good. You know, your chihuahua's been shitting in my yard. I'm so sorry. Are you okay, honey? What's this, Sue? This is Sue, mother effing Dylan, honey. <laughs> oh my god, I know she was in your yard. I'm so sorry. I forgive you, honey. Oh my I oh love my gosh, you. Should I get rid of her? Like, what should I do? No, don't get rid of her, honey. I for You know what? Don't even worry about it. You know, I think I saw somebody's cat out there eating up the shit anyway. It can. It's oh. fine. And you know how I feel about cats, honey, so if that thing gets worms and passes on, that's fine. Oh my god, my, oh my god, my, <laughs> You are tickling me pink, honey. I hope you have a good week. You too. I love you so much. 
<laughs> I love you too, sweet pea. What a nice scale. Nice broad. Okay, Lucy. Lucy. Uh, can Mike, can somebody pin Mike's, one of Mike's comments, Mike. Pin Mike. Pin Mike on TikTok. Thank you, Brett. Lucy. Can someone pin Mike? Mike. Mike Hunt. I love you, honey. This man, he can find anything out, honey. Don't say if, <laughs> if you need somebody found or any info about anybody, DM Mike. He'll find it. Follow him. He is the MVP mod. He made the bulletin. He makes those old ass faces, those pictures he sends me that. This man gives me so much free content. Give him a follow. He's also on my live wave agency team and he goes live and so give him a follow and show him some love. <clears throat> anyway, Lucy, it's your turn. Yes, Mike Jones. I just wanted to let you know that your um, that your brother-in-law Bob gave me your number. Um, he said that you're a very talented farrier serviceman. Um, I need my foot worked on. I got a wart and a callus, and I got a a hook foot. What is that called? A toe? A hammer toe? Hammer toe? Hammer time, honey. Uh, and I was wondering if you could take a look at it. Um, it's really in, it's festered up and it hurts really bad. If you'd please take a look. Bye, honey. Thank you, Brett. Okay, where's Ryan in the house? Is Ryan in the house? Is Ryan in the house? Pin Ryan, honey. Pin Ryan Broussard. Pin that Cajun mama. Pin him, please, if you can. Ryan, is he in the house? Call me Bertha. This one is from Insta. A subscriber. Thank you, Brett. Hello, is this Mike? Hello, I'm Michelle's great aunt Sue, and I just wanted to say hello. She will not stop talking about you. How you doing? I'm great. I just wanted to get to know you a little better and see what your intentions are with my niece. You better treat her right, is all I gotta say. Alright, no problem. Um, you work, you get to work good tomorrow, honey. I'm sorry to bother you. No problem, thanks. Good night. Sweet dreams. You as well. Don't let the bed bugs bite. 
is Ryan in here? Thank you, Brett. Thank you, call me Pap. Is, uh, Holly Rob in here? Pin Holly Rob. Pin Holly Rob. Pin. Give Holly Rob a follow. She is in my agency as well. She is my aunt and she is my most special mod. Please. Give her a follow. I do not pick favorites, but I could not do this stuff without my mod, so show them some love. She's my aunt in law. Chelsea Leanne, 26. Chelsea Leanne. Leanne. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to... Is Brenda in the house. I love you too, honey. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hey, Mike, this is Sue. Um, I'm calling you because um, somebody shat in the commode of the RV that I bought, and I want to get a different one. I want to trade it out. This is not going to work. So, please give me a call back when you can. Bye. Okay. Y'all know the drill. This is my mama and my mod, and she's behind the scenes doing a bunch of stuff on the computer right now. Show her some love and give her a follow. We couldn't do it without them. Thank you, Brett. Okay, Ruby. Is Ryan here now? If Ryan ain't here, then pin carry. Ryan Broussard. This little biatch, honey. He does a lot, too. You know the drill. If you love me, you love them, give them a follow. Thank you, Brett. And then we just have one more. That's a whole team of people that's making this happen, y'all. And they are doing so good. So good. So, so good. good. So good. Carrie Millsap. <coughs> Give Carrie a follow. Carrie does a lot with social media, so you can check her out. <coughs> her son is very sweet and a big Sue fan. And I put him on my story sometimes, actually. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. Thank you, Brad. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, Cup please of record Nudie. message. And that's what they call her son, Nudie. Um, so give her a follow, please. May I help you? May I help you? Hello? May I help you? Uh, you are calling my brother for me. I'm sorry. Who are you? I don't know who the hell you are, honey. I don't know what you want me to say. Are you trying to scam me, lady? You called my brother looking for me. No, I did not, honey. Quit making stuff up trying to get my credit card number. Nobody's trying to. I don't you need You left him a voicemail on his phone. I will not stand for this gaslighting. Really? No. It is 2024, ma'am. No shit. You do not gaslight old women on the phone. Nobody's gaslighting you. You called my brother's phone 14 times. I did not call your brother's phone 14 times. I don't have the ability to do that. I have a certain amount of minutes. You think I would call someone 14 times? That's insane. Would you insane. like the voicemail? Yes. I mean, I can have him send it. Go ahead. I did not call him 14 times. I tell you that right now. Okay. And, is that it? I'll have him send the voicemail, and I'll send it to you where you say your name and that you're looking for me. I did not call anybody 14 times. No. Okay. No. Well, I'll send you proof in just a minute. Send the picture of how many times I called, too, because I'm interested. Oh, I will. Okay. Uh, I did not call anybody 14 times. Ever. Hell no. Thank you, Brett. Thank you, Holly GJ. <clears throat> I want to run 
him first. And then we can get it. They're open all day. Oh my gosh, thank you, Brett and Holly. Thank you guys so much. forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hey, David, this is Sue. Um, I live in this same apartment complex as you, and I seen you out in your police uniform, and uh, you just look too damn good for words, and do you need a sugar mama? Because I can be that for you, honey. I got all kinds of riches. I draw money from welfare now. Um, and I got the check coming in every month that I have your name written on, baby. So just call me back when you can. Okay. Was that the last one? Yes. That was the last one. Um. Of the night. Thank you guys for being here. Um. Thank you for the gifts. That's crazy. That we're in the rankings. I... Never would have thought that. And it's all because of your work. So thank you for giving us all the recognition that we work really hard for. Because it's all y'all too. You give me ideas. You give me people to prank. Couldn't do it without you. So um, I hope you guys have a great night. And have a good week. And hopefully your Sunday scaries are a little bit better. Yes, you are all... Amazing. I, f I usually have a whole thing I have to say. Um, if you want merch, you can order some. Um, it's after midnight, it's gone, but the merch code to get 15% off is code SUE, S -U -E, and I do believe it has international shipping for everything but the stickers. So go check that out, and I will see y'all another time. I'm, try I'm trying to do hollowbacks tomorrow, but let me just be completely transparent. My stuff is going viral on three different platforms right now and so I'm having a large influx of orders that I'm not used to and I also have a test on Wednesday and I have to work Thursday so I'm gonna try to go live some more but I don't know if I'll be back if I'm not I'm not going nowhere long term but I just need some time and if you're if you order a call please read the description in the description it says I have up to five days to complete it I try not to take that long I try to get it done within three but it might take me good night Brett everybody follow Brett it might take me that long. Please give me some grace. I am losing my mind answering emails. This is a one-man show except for my wives. My husband helps me. But, like, it's me doing the videos. It's me returning emails. So, please look stuff up first before you email me silly questions. Look in your junk folder for the video. Because I'm going crazy up here. I'm going crazy. If you got a free subscriber call today, um, I don't do them immediately, and I didn't skip you. If I didn't, if I didn't send you some kind of message back, I'm not doing it today. I just got done. It's eight thirty six. I'm thirty minutes over. You didn't get it today. Um, just because you subscribe does not mean you get to go immediately or the next Sunday after you subscribe. I wish it was that way, but it is not. So if I did not respond to you, I will, and I will let you know what Sunday you're gonna go on. If you still think I didn't do it, you can email me about that. But. Good night, guys.